Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, once again, it's one of those days that I'm like literally filming all my intros ahead of time and I'm out of ideas. I have absolutely no clue what I'll be making for this video, but you will soon find out. If this is your first time here, welcome. Thanks so much for joining me today, you guys. I would love it if you became part of the DIY family by subscribing to my channel and hitting that bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. All right, let's get on to the DIY. Okay, so today's video is going to be a farmhouse spring look with this super cute set. It's nice, simple, and easy, and super inexpensive. So let's get on to it. I'm going to start this out with a recycled DIY. So this one is two of the larger terracotta pots from Dollar Tree. I just whitewashed them with some white acrylic paint and then wrapped them with the Dollar Tree twine and these are the smaller ones. The smaller ones come in a pack of three and the bigger ones come in a pack of two. These were originally planters but I'm gonna change them up to make some candle holders and I had the perfect size candle. I think this one's from Dollar Tree from a while back and then this larger one I bought at like Walmart or maybe someone gave it to me. I don't know but it fit in there perfectly. I just made sure to like put it in there really well and then kind of twist it so the wax would catch to the pot and it doesn't move around. Digging in my stockpile I have a bunch of greenery so I'm just taking these little berry stems uh, pieces I guess and put them into the twine. This is the original DIY. I will go ahead and link it down below and then above so you guys can see exactly how I made them. brought to me <laughs> look it 100k <laughs> happy birthday <laughs> thank you schmubby look okay i'll read it schmubby <laughs> oh i like it i haven't even opened it yet but Oh, look at it. Oh, is it for my Dollar Tree spending? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so for this next one, we're going to take one of these Dollar Tree vases and then some of this vinyl liner, which I absolutely love. I will show you guys in the next uh, DIY exactly what it looks like, you know, before I unroll it. And then I'm just going to glue it just one end on there, roll it nicely so that the glue kind of uh, spreads out and then just roll it over and glue the other end. Um, I don't put all kinds of glue on the rest of it just because if I do want to take it off I don't have to worry about you know removing all that gunk. And instead of using floral foam, I'm going to be using a piece of the pool noodle, which fits perfectly, and then some Dollar Tree flower bundles. And as you guys can see here, it just fits perfectly inside the pool noodle. It holds them nice and tightly, and just stick it in there and top it with some floral moss. Last but not least, I will be using this Dollar Tree plastic cutting board, just removing the sticker and taking my measuring square. I am going to measure or I am going to draw a line, you know, sort of at the top. I think it's about maybe two inches. Could be more. I don't know. I didn't really measure it. I just thought it looked good there. And then this is the Dollar Tree vinyl liner. I love this color. You know, it's like the faux wood or whatever. Um, I know they have like the darker brown one, which I don't really care for. So I'm really happy that I found this one. And these are newer to my Dollar Tree. So I took a bunch of them home just because, you know, I don't want to risk not seeing them again. So I'm just going to measure out the piece like right along the line that I made and cut it out and using some tacky glue I'm gonna glue it on there before I do that though I am gonna use this craft wise chalkboard paint from Dollar Tree and I'm gonna give it a good uh, two coats with this foam brush and making sure that the first coat dries before you add the second one I sped up the process by using my hair dryer because I hate waiting for paint to dry it's like watching paint dry 
Like the fire in a cheetah Like a star about to fall A fever rush inside me when I see her mm, I'm a dice to roll I've told you guys this before but since I do have baby wipes near me all the time they are actually great to use when you get paint on your hands so anytime I'm working with paint and I get it on there it works really really well to remove all of that any whoosie before I do my writing on my board I'm just gonna take some extra greenery again I have it in my stockpile I have so much to use and just gonna put it together with some twine and then glue it onto the board And just so you guys know, I am using this Dollar Tree chalk crayon. Um, it's in the craft section. I don't know if they still have them or not, but I have it on hand. And uh, yeah, that's it. my father's voice he would tell me to move on he would say I'll be just fine yeah he would tell me we have time time to laugh and time to heal a favorite song is on repeat drinking wine until the dawn
guys, that is going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you leave me a thumbs up. You guys know how much those help me out. Leave me your comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Drinking wine until the dawn.